the first person to reach 100% was Janusz Lewski from Poland. Congrats to him. He, let's say, opened the doors for all of us to find it. Hello, bridge players. Welcome once again to the quest for the 100% fee. In this video, we play the weekly fee in Saint tournament and we get to 100% in each and every hand if possible. Hand number one, we start with six spades. That's what we need to play. Nothing more, nothing less. We now come to our hand for a little finesse. We draw this from, then we come back to our hand, and it becomes an interesting play. We transfer the menace in. Uh, Diamonds to East. And now we play our last trump and we finesse. And this is the coup de grace. He throws this, we throw this. And it's good, and we claim the rest. Good enough for 100%. Hand number two, we start with one spade. Then we play the no trump. We get this lead and we let it go to our seven. And we play the six. I don't understand why the robot would do such a thing. Now we've got all these tricks and we're going to play small diamond wings and helps us with the finesse. We come here and then we Our clubs, we come to our hand, we play this and give away a trick, which is good enough for 100%. Hand number three, we can start with one spade and then beat six, no trump. This is very unusual, but it's the way we can do it so that the robot makes the mistake he's going to make. The queen, we play with our eights, we cash our hearts, and that was terrible discard because the rest is ours, good enough for 100%. Hand number four we beat to no trump and then we beat four spades. Another weird sequence which will allow us to squeeze or pseudo squeeze the robot. We spot here our trumps, we can also rough our loser and then we go to our spades. 
We just need this, this card, and that's good enough for 100%. Hand number five, we start with one club. This is in order to take a suit from them. This way, they let us play. You can here try to set up a rough at the table. So, draw trumps. Which we should do, of course. And, uh, Going to have a couple of tricks. Diamonds. But that, my friends, is good enough for one hundred percent. We are going to pass initially here. We are going to I believe they have thrown away spades, so we can make it like this, but we were going to have to restart. Because one way to do this is just to start with one diamond, of course. But anyway, we got to 12 tricks, which is good enough for 100%. Hand number seven. It's a natural for me because I open a spade and then I doubled parts. The robot beat three diamonds, which was my fear. And I went to three spades. They laid a heart, which I won, of course. And I tried to go to the table in order to play a spade, but I was surprised. Next, I won here and played a king of spades. I don't know why the robot did this, but he helped a lot. I was allowed to win that, but then I drew the last trump, and that, my friends, was good enough for 100%. Hand number eight, I would also call it a natural. I also got 100% naturally, because I doubled here, which is not probably the best course of action. My partner got four diamonds, which I passed, because he was supposed to have more diamonds on hearts. And then I got to double five clubs. I decided to draw trumps with my lead, which was a great idea because partner didn't have the queen of uh, hearts. So we're just gonna take two tricks, which means 300. The rest is theirs, but that's good enough for 100%. Hand number nine, 
So 100% all around, we did it again with uh, 9 minutes and 50 seconds, just short, 3 seconds to reach uh, Mark Bolodin. The first person to reach 100% was Janusz Lewski from Poland. Congrats to him. He, let's say, opened the doors for all of us to find it. I have to thank, as usual, Mark Bolodin for sending his uh, results and also 007007 Bond, who also showed me that some hands could be faster. And uh, as usual, I will ask you to leave your like in YouTube and to follow the channel. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. See you again next time. Bye.